Hey guys, this is the first audio recording that uh, we'll be putting out. Uh, I've tried to do this like three or four times, it just not worked out right. Uh, I'm going to show you my practice sessions, how I do my practice sessions. The first lap, I don't do much on the first lap. First time around, and then when they come come around to the start finish line, I do so what pretty much pick what I call pace. a qualifying run. Okay. Do a qualifying lap, the very first lap, and then harvest and go down to standard. Uh, this is what I do. I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna do a fourth season on this with this one. This is the third season with Williams, uh, with Gasly, Pierre Gasly, and P Oscar Piastri. I was considering doing a new season, new career with either Williams or Haas, and using the original staff and the original drivers. Uh, and see if I could take them to a championship. I know that's a lot, that's, that would be a lot harder to do with the original staff and original drivers and all that. Imagine trying to take uh, Latifi, Goat Tifi, or Mick Schumacher, or Kevin Magnuson, or Al Blonda to a championship that that sounds very difficult but it actually sounds intriguing to me I just skip through the speed through the first practice at Mexico how's the balance at this stage Go ahead and readjust. That's probably pretty close. That's probably really close to 100%. Or it should be anyway. I'm going to put on the medium tires. And child. <laughs> uh, uh, the reason I don't get to post videos all the time is I have a full time job, so. Yeah, I actually have work tomorrow night. So I might be able to post, put one on, get a video on tomorrow. Maybe. I'm, I'm going to try to, but if not, I won't be able to until maybe Monday, because I work all weekend, so.
I'll have to leave it like that. Me too, eight seven point five. Medium tires. I don't look like too bad. We'll try that out for piastri. How's the balance? Go ahead and send him out on his second run. See how this turns out. This is I usually do this till I get a hundred percent, and then after I get a hundred, if I can get a hundred percent within the first two practice sessions, and I I usually skip to the, simulate the last practice session. Let the, Let it do its own thing for the third practice session. Uh, I never, I never skip qualifying. I do all three rounds of the qualifying. I will let the drivers do their own thing most of the time. If I feel like they're not close enough to get that. Use the RS off of other drivers, and I will take control of them. But usually, I just, I just let them run it, run it themselves. So. That's Gasly's car. So what do we need to work on? So the rear wing is perfect.
I don't look too bad. That looks looks really good. Optimal straight, the traction is great, so it's pretty close to optimal. Cornering should be close to optimal. Brake stability should be close also, along with oversteer. So it should be 90-95% the next time. So just on the way, if you give us some feedback on the tools and what Yeah, she's 85%. So bring Piastri in. Uh, 13 for Piastri on the rear wing. So a lot of a lot of these guys like to try to do their setup by the same way they did the the F one twenty two game, which is kind of different than the way this is set up because the drivers have their own personal setup, so you can't actually go by what they did with F one twenty two, F one twenty two, and this. Should be better. The brake stability in the corner is what worries me, though. Understood. Because sometimes you can go the wrong way with it and it make it worse. for the last one make him run a little harder <laughs> and the 
first practice session is almost over. I'd like to at least get, I'd like to get four, but I doubt I'm making it to four. Someone spun out. That'll be the session yeah. over. Okay, yeah, she got to three. I'll be able to get to, get to four. in the first practice session. So. Traction's not perfect, but it looks like his oversteer cornering and uh, his oversteer cornering and straights are perfect. So, let's check Piastri. How's his looking? His straights and traction's perfect. His braking stability's great, but not perfect. That means he's close, really, probably really close. He's probably 95% or higher. Save real quick. Always make sure you save just in case because you never know what could happen. Power outage, anything. And you just lost everything you just did for the first practice. First lap is always, always done with a qualifying lap. And we're expecting to rain here in a little bit. How's the balance? Gasly's 93% now. So that's really good. So, uh, weather update. Uh, we are expecting some rain. Copy. The gas at 93%. This be, should be a lot easier to do now. So. Yeah, this thing, do you take anti-roll back to 3.7 or forward to 1.9? Thank you. 
Hmm. You know what? Let me try three seven first. track so intermediate should be fine. I must MPS you on another qualifying lap. See if he can improve. Do you need any help with the uh, balance at this stage? It does improve. I see he's 99%. So. I can literally, I can keep Piastri out until, until he wears the tires out. So. so the rain that we have oh, to the one. Just look after this tire set though. Look after it. Copy. Charge off when you're ready. Yeah. And the rain has started. Point three five point two five. Point three five point two five. What's our point two five right now? No intermediate. Piastri will be either 100% or 98%. I don't know. I'll have Piastri will end up being 100%. So easily. How 
Casualties now at 100%. So the third practice session will be simulated. Sounds like someone's locked up. Here's the replay. Now look at this. It's Pierre Gasly. It's a lockup. Thank God he moved away from that car. Thank God. That don't happen a lot. When they lock up with a car in front of them, usually they take out the car in front of them. So, yep, this is this whole practice is pretty much over with. Not bad, not bad at all. Ocon with a spin. I have ninety percent weather prediction. But yet somehow somehow it's almost never right. Look how far off it is. It didn't even start raining until a quarter of the way in. And they said it was gonna rain within the first First few minutes. How's the balance? Yeah, I went the wrong way with Castry. At least I know where it's at. Just go ahead and bring both guys in at the same time. And PS Stream probably won't be able to he won't probably won't get his this run done. This run finished before the second practice ends, but he will be at hundred percent. If you can get within a couple percentage points, usually that's how many. At 97, 98. You move it, move, move one or two things. Move one, more. Virtual safety car. Move one thing twice, or three times. Like 97 percent, you got three percent left. Move it three spots, and it should be 100 percent. And we have a crash involved. That's McLaren. Is that a McLaren? It looks like a McLaren, yep. Ooh. Ooh, they took McLaren out. Wow. Oh, took both of them out, didn't he? They took each other out? So oh, yeah, Lando took out McLaren. <laughs> Lando takes out McLaren. Wow. And the rain was not supposed to continue the entire practice, but it did. Wow. That'll be the session over. Yeah, and that is two practice sessions down. The third one to go. So, you know, let's simulate the third one. Hello, and thank
thank you for joining us as our race weekend unfolds. Free practice is nearly done, and that means that qualifying awaits. Each team will be looking to build on the progress they made during yesterday's practice sessions. When it comes to preparation, absolutely nothing should be left to chance. Everything has to be just right. Of course, by the time the cars hit the track, well, there are some things in Formula One that no one can prepare for. You're going to want to join us for this, folks, so fasten your seatbelts. Yes, I've watched some of the YouTubers who also play this game struggle with getting their card to the point where they can compete with it for the championship and the main things you need to work on to compete with for the championship is design your a lot of front wings rear wings and under floors yes the chassis side pods and suspension help but not nothing like the front wing rear wing and under floor those three you design I've got seven or six, seven or eight of those, each of those, in this third season of Williams here. And that's why we are head and shoulders above everybody else. So, that's how I went from first season uh, not even being competing with anything winning the race or two toward the end of the season to winning the championship the second season and now winning it again and these two drivers these two guys are competing for the championship Piastri is 35 points behind Gasly with three races to go so Gasly is more than likely going to become a two time champion unless something drastic happens but Simulate the last session. Yes. Claire's got a penalty. Claire has a penalty because Lando Norris took him out in the second practice. Max, Piastri, Gasly. and destroy it but other than that I will not buy another engine ERS or gearbox Let's see seven front wings eight rear wings six hundred floors only three chassis two side pods three suspensions yes they help the chassis side pod and suspension helps with, with helps some with speed and either the engine cooling or uh, brake cooling but other than that to actually compete with Ferrari, Red Bull, Mercedes for the front wing, rear wing and under floor design, design those as much as you possibly can you design those and you can compete with them really really quickly that's why I'm, I'm, I'd like to see if I could get take either Williams and Albon and Latifi or Haas and Magnuson and Schumacher and see if I can 
with the all original staff and take them to a championship within the third year. That's what I'd like to do. So as soon as this season's over, that's what we're going to start working on. Yeah. I still have a few more minutes. I can only record an hour each time because we're out. I only I record my videos on a PlayStation, so. I don't have a computer or anything like that. So I have to have to get it done within an hour. So I'm gonna let you all watch the qualifying also. First round, I ain't worry about it. So, PSG will make it out of the first round. And in the second round, I will use the same exact tires and try to make it into the final top 10. I should be able to with the same tires. No problem at all. Third round, third and final round of qualifying. Run two, run two qualifying laps with two fresh sets of soft, maybe, or I might run two with one, a fresh set to start off with and run it again. soft tires on for both guys when yeah we should be fine I'll actually send Gasly out first this time that way maybe I can get a, we can get an idea of radio check copy it And the summer staff are going to get in the way. Yeah, they're close. I think Verstappen actually helped Gasly on that one. So we will be able to run the third practice session. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna run it. the third qualifying, the first lap of the third quali third round with fresh soft tires, and the second lap will be with the same set of tires. So, and the first time I will have Fiesta going out first, and the second time I'll have Gasly going out first. That way, both of them get it. Get the pull from the DRS, so you get help from DRS. They literally help each other. Is what we're doing. 
I have found out that's the best way to do it. Send one out the first time. Send one out first, the first lap. Second lap, send the other one out first. And when you do that, it, you usually end up uh, with a one, two qualifying. It definitely at least uh, both of you starting in top three. Send Piastri out first this time. And I'll send Gasly out first. Oh, crap. Going to use Oak. Going to get in the way. Same tires. Same tires. That way they're together. Uh, we're gonna get hung up. Dag on it. Yeah, we're stopping out ahead of PS3, but that's fine. Gasly still wins, gets the pole. Gasly can clinch the championship pretty much with a win here. With 35 point lead. And that will end qualifying. And final preparations are underway. Williams made short work of the qualifying session here and has been rewarded with strong grid position to start the race. While this isn't the strongest grid position for Ferrari, qualifying isn't everything. I'm curious to see if they can go against the tide and make this race work for them. And the sun is shining bright here today. This is perfect weather for teams and drivers alike to show us what they're capable of. Well, there's some serious decision making ahead for teams and the drivers as we begin the Mexican Grand Prix. And now we have two sets of soft tires to use for the race. Uh, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to worry about that one. One thirty-eight fifty, one thirty-eight forty-three. Soft, medium, soft.
cash on that setup. sessions and qualifying for Mexico. Let me know what anybody yeah let me know what you think about for the next season should I try for Williams to take the original staff of Williams, the original drivers and staff of Williams or the original staff and drivers of Haas and take them to the championship. See if I can do it within a couple of years. Two to three years. Well, three years. See if I can do it within three years. That sounds like the best challenge for me. Because it's getting kind of easy for me. So I figure to make it a little bit more difficult. Take the original drivers and take them. If I can get Goat TV to a championship, I believe people would lose their mind. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, comment.